Now that I got your attention, I'm gonna go over why these taillights suck, and these taillights are fantastic. So the Maxfield Trailtail taillight starts with our unique three-piece design. The modular base unit houses the LED circuit board. Our LEDs are all soldered directly to the metal circuit board, and then it gets bolted to the housing and filled with resin. LEDs still create heat, so that heat needs to go somewhere. So we leave this whole void back here open, cover it with this plate, let your wires come out the back, and then we fill the whole thing up with resin to keep it waterproof, crush proof, uh, all kinds of proof. Brightest lights on the market, it's got 135 red LEDs, 16 white LEDs. Red LEDs are for the stop and turn and, turn, and, and side marker, and the white LEDs are for your reverse lights. Brightest taillight option on the market, there's your running light, there's your stop lamp, there's your reverse, and uh, the, it's truly the brightest, longest lasting, best warranted light on the market. Warranties lifetime, no BS. If you break it, we'll replace it. Just videotape whatever you're doing because it was pretty awesome. Which leads me to my next point. This video is gonna cover some of the torture tests we went through, as well as testimonials so you can understand why it's the best light we've got. So today we're gonna do, we're gonna do a little product testing, but we just figured we'd do it in a few a little unconventional ways. We'll see how uh, Maxwell Trail Tails hold up to the old Louisville Slugger. Nice ash wood bat. Let's get it done. Well, that's good. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. No failures there. Got them all. Real bright. Real yeah. bright. Oh, let's get the. Oop, there they are. All good. Oof, still good to go. Cool. Let's smash one with the bat. <laughs> Grand slam. <laughs> Grand slam. Oh my god. That would have went out of the park. <laughs> to walk off Still. and run. Ooh. <laughs> How many licks does it take, huh? Ha! Ooh, Ooh. Chunks. What was Still that? <laughs> what was that? I don't know. Oh, there's stuff falling from the ceiling. It has seen better days. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the reverse side's still... That's still good. Oh yeah, see, she's being a little compromised there. Well, just, oh, look at that. Still, it still works. Yeah, still works. 
Yeah. A little bit of the... That's really busted. This bat is junk. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, give it to So here we are in a uh, heavy equipment work zone. They're doing some uh, equipment things. Equipment things with heavy machinery. So we thought, what a better spot to do some product testing than with these fellers. So we're going to see if they can use some of their toys to put our lights to the test. Let's do this. Oh boy. Oh, oh, oh. Money. Oh, uh, we buried him. Well, well, well. Uh, well, let's see if that one still works. Well, let's just see what happens. All right, the dozer test. Crunch. That's a lot of weight. That's uh, okay. I'd say the test is pretty much between it there. The proof is in the pudding, as they say. All right. This one took it pretty good. This one for sure. It's golden on this one. Oh, yeah. This is the dozer smasher. Oh. A couple, not too many. Made it through the dozer. Dozer smasher two. That one is pretty bent. Still good. Woo! Holy moly. All right, we'll take that. Oh, she really bent. This one's real bent. <laughs> She's real bent. And it works. Uh, oh, kablooey. <laughs> Hold it up so you see how bent that sucker is. Yeah, we just... Uh, Look at the back of it. It's, oh, yeah. She's, she's pretty bent. <laughs> but uh, looking good. <laughs> like to see that. <laughs> All right, well, on to the excavator smashing ones. Same. So that one is the one that we originally used. Oh, yeah, this one was already. That was the one that we beat up with the baseball bat. It's still it's got a few bad. of them there. It's, uh, that one's in rough shape. Well, all things considered. Here's one that, uh, should we do the, <laughs> why don't we test this one? Oh, well. Oh, oh boy. Let's go for, we'd like to see uh, 50%. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, all of the reverse lights still work. <laughs> the rest is not looking good. <laughs> Only six LEDs lit up. The excavator did a little more damage. The dozer didn't do anything to him except bend him. Yeah, yeah. Well, all right. Remember, lifetime warranty. So even if you beat it up with an excavator, you still get your lights replaced for free. <laughs> and for our next trick, we're going to be running over these lights with a big wheel loader. So I say thanks to American Express here in Eau Claire, Wisconsin for uh, taking a, a couple moments out of their very busy day to help us with our product testing. So uh, here goes nothing.
thing is like freaking wires not there we go. That's crazy town. Right where the dozer ran it over, there's a section out. Oh! Yeah, they're not. Fixed it. Yep, they're all lit up. Ran over by a bulldozer. Okay. Even if that happens, uh, you just got to call us up. It's a lifetime warranty, so we'll just replace it. Um, and we just really hope that however you break it, you get it on film, because it was probably really cool whatever you were doing. My name is Ed Fernanski, who has purchased my uh, trail tails about four years ago after a horrible trail accident. Well, we were in a line of Jeeps and it was dark and raining, and I was leading the group, and a rabbit ran out in front of me. I had to slam on the brakes. And I still had my stock taillights. And unfortunately, Tom hit me from behind and he couldn't make it off the trail. He didn't make it. But now that I have my trail tails, life's been so much better. Everyone can see me and I always lead the group. Thank <laughs> you.